Just got this in. So this is the Heliway 903 and it is one of the best toy drones that I've flown and I really mean that. It is definitely one of the best. It just flies well. I don't I don't know how to explain it without actually taking it up in the air and just showing you how it is. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, so let's just go over a little bit of the specifications here. It comes with 8 millimeter brushed motors, which I definitely attribute to why it flies so well in this form factor. It's got a lot of good power on this drone. Uh, the battery is unfortunately a non-standard battery. I'm going to show it to you right here. It is a 600 milliamp hour battery, but it does have a uh, standard connector, which is good. I'm going to get. It. I'll tell you a little bit about that later. So I'm going to go ahead and plug this in, and let's just let's just get it in the air because it is cool. I really want you guys to see that. The controller, I don't feel like I need to go over the controls very much because unlike most other drones, uh, the controller is very well labeled. Everything is uh, properly labeled. This is funny, it's a super R-lip mode. <laughs> but other than that, the controller is solidly built. And it's also, it also doesn't have a cheap plastic feel. I don't know what this is on the outside of it, but it, the controller, it just feels nice. But the first thing I want you guys to notice is how quiet it is. Look at how quiet that is. It's such a smooth, quiet, flying drone. I've got, uh, I consistently get six to seven minutes of flight time with the stock battery as well. Depending on your flying style, you'll get more or less. If I'm flying really aggressively, I'm gonna get about five minutes. But yeah, look at that. I mean, it is really, really, really smooth. And it just sounds so good. It's pleasant. It's pleasant sounding. It's a pleasant sounding drone. All right, so um, I know some people have trouble with flips on this drone. When you get low on battery, it won't let you flip. So make sure you get your flips out of the way early in the flight. It can do forward flips, back flips, right flips, all sorts of flips. And it does them well, too. There's no sink. Very nice. Now, uh, it's got rates, and I don't, I'm not really a fan of adjusting rates on a dial, but whatever. You adjust them on a dial. So, uh, I guess these are the slowest rates. And you really have, like, no angle when you're on the lowest rates. You see that? That's pretty much the extent of your angle. But then we're going to turn it up a notch. Now we got some angle on this thing. That's how I want to fly. I'm just going to keep it in the high rates for all, all, for the entire flight. If you're new, though, I guess, yeah, you could dial it down and uh, enjoy it that way. I'm going to turn off the lights in the back because I don't want to waste the battery. It's another thing you can do to just save a little bit of battery. Yeah, but the Heliway is a joy to fly. It really is. Look at it. Look at just zipping around. All right. I'm going to try flying down the field. We have... I mean, the thing is really, really small, so you're going to have a hard time seeing it in, at a distance. But I'm going to try to fly it all the way out, oh, as far as I can. Oh my gosh. Okay, I have to pull it back. Woo! Look at it. Look at how fast it is. This thing is nimble. I love it. It's just a, it, it's just a joy to fly. It's really really fun. There are parts available for it in case you break it. The batteries are reasonably priced. I mean, it's just a good flyer. I'm actually just uh, hard on the throttle right now. I'm literally just pushing it.
But yeah, now I'm starting to fly aggressively. I'm gonna turn the lights back on. Oh wait, what the heck did I do? Oh, I did headless mode. Ah, oh, I hate that. But I, I think headless mode in this works pretty well too, probably. Oh, no it doesn't. No it doesn't. Probably because I need to do it from the beginning. Oh well, I hate headless mode. But it is there if you want it. I'm just flying full manual. And that's the one that I think you should get when you buy this. Don't buy the one with altitude hold. It, ru it just ruins the fun. It ruins the fun. It might be a little easier, I guess, if you're new to get the altitude hold one, but I think it just ruins the fun. It's so maneuverable. I'm just trying to wait to see when the batteries run out so far right now. I consistently, like I said, I'm getting about six minutes, six to seven minutes. I'm flying mega aggressively for this review just to show you guys the sheer power of this thing. Could just do a quick little punch out, I guess. Oh, now we have the low battery light. Uh, just so you guys know, when this thing is low on battery, it'll just it just drops. It doesn't land. It doesn't self land. You're just gonna see this thing bottom out. Probably pretty shortly. Actually, I'm not gonna let it fall on the ground. It's too nice. It's too good of a drone to let it just fall on the ground like that. So yeah, that's the Heliway 903. Now, like I said, the only thing that's bad about this drone, in my opinion, is the proprietary battery. But I'm gonna show you something. With a charger like this and a cable like this, as you can see, this is actually a, a uh, this is called the JSTPH 2.0 connector. All you need to do is plug this little adapter into here, and then you could charge this with any charger you want. And this is actually the charger that I use for all my micros. It's the UPS6. And I'm able to just sit out here and charge this in the field. Here, I'm gonna plug this in. And that's it, it's ready to go. I'm charging out here in the field. So like I said, batteries for this are pretty reasonable. You, you get a pack of these for about 15, 14 bucks. And there you go. And then you can get a unit like this and charge them all up. But uh, overall, like I said, I like this drone. It's a great flyer. And I, I would highly recommend if you're in the market for looking for a new toy drone. All right, guys, so that's it. That's the end of the review. Let me know if you guys have any questions or comments. Uh, leave them down below. And uh, as always, have a great day, guys.